about how far you are uh, in terms of gaining your financial freedom uh, so that it kind of motivates you know our listeners you know how you know how how much space do you need to create a financial freedom basically so to say yeah i would say that we are getting pretty close there um at the at this point right now we've done about 13 deals as passive investors ourselves we've done about 5 5 deals as general partners um, on the active side of things. And so all that combined has really accelerated our path to financial freedom. Um, We're still working our current active, or we're still currently working our W-2 jobs right now, but we're taking all that active income and investing it in passive investments, passive opportunities, so that our money is also working hard for us while we are also working hard for our money. So combined, those two strategies are really going to accelerate our path to um, early retirement, to the financial freedom uh, journey that we're looking for. Well, Aline, you, you, are, you are an ideal avatar for this show and for my real estate business, where you know somebody who has been investing in the real estate uh, who knows about real estate, or even if you didn't know about real estate, you started, you know, just a couple of years ago, like four years ago, you know, you uh, obviously you and your spouse, you know, you guys worked to, you know, both full time and, and, and you took a plunge into real estate and you started investing in, in real estate just three, four years ago. And you are at a level where you're invested in 13 deals as passive investors your money is already making money. You know, you are making money in W2, but whatever your savings are, that money is uh, is also getting compounded every year. And on top of that, because of your diligence, because of your hard work, you have taken, jump into the pond where, you know, you have become GP on five deals and you are, you know, I, I'm sure you are almost there to start sponsoring a deal, maybe in a couple of, maybe this year or maybe in the next next couple of years. Uh, 